Hello everybody, my name is Master Chu, and welcome to the Captain America Shield. So, the first thing we're going to be working on is you need a huge piece of um, poster board. And you're also going to need at least one weight. Oh, crap. And then, um, probably, preferably a five gallon bucket lid. That close the door for a second. Preferably a five gallon bucket lid. Um, you can get those at, like, fishing stores, or you can just use some... If you were a hunter, some people would use them for that. And what you're going to do is you're going to set that five-gallon bucket lid in the center. It's a little bit off. There we go, in the center. And then you're going to set the weight down. When you put the weight down, take out a pencil or something dark enough, and then just trace the outline of that. This way, you got the beginning of the first red line outside of the blue, which is where the star is. Go around this twice, and then you got the beginning. Next thing we're going to do is we're going to find something smaller to fit that. So we got the beginning, and then we're going to have, this is the red line. We're going to have a white line, and then we're going to have a red line. When we get that, we're going to have a little blue space in here, but we're not going to do that yet. So I'll be right back. If any of you guys know what this is, it's a party panel lid. You need to use these for like birthdays and stuff. We're going to set this in the center of this, so we have about an inch off of each. So yeah, we have it in the center. It's an inch around it, as you can see. And we're going to set the weight on top of that. Next thing we're going to do is we're going to trace it with the pencil. If you want, you can trace it with blue marker or red to get started out for you. But I'm just going to keep using pencil for now. So we're going to trace that. And this is going to be our blue. Now the blue is where, gonna be, is where the star is going to be. And that star is probably the cent is the center of the whole thing. So we got the base, we got the blue, we've got the yellow, the red, and we got the white, and we got the blue. So I'm gonna need a couple of stuff, and yeah, I'll be right back once again. Since I can't find anything bigger than that, um, besides this cushion piece, and that's too big. Um, what we can do is we can just sketch an outline of it. Or we can take the little party pill again and just go on each four corners, but keep a straight line around it. And we have to measure an inch off. So I got a yardstick here, because the paper's that big. We're going to measure about an inch off of the paper. Now an inch is going to be from 31, inch, 31 to 32, we're going to mark it on both sides. So over here it's going to be 19 to 17, to 18. We're going to mark that. So this is where the line's going to be. I like that. I'm going to highlight this. And this is the base for our Captain America shield. So as you can see, we've got two little lines on each side. And what we're going to do is we're going to cut those out, but we're also going to use a compass on each side to line it up. And when that happens, that compass will be put right here on each corner. So right here and here. That compass will line up to the point where we turn it and it will create the shield. And we'll have to like use the compass um, on a round scale. And a round scale is basically a circle that has a, it's not a, it's a protractor, not a round scale, a protractor. A protractor. So what we can do is we can stretch the side out with our five gallon bucket lid. We can go to the corner here. And, or you can just spread it out a little. And we can make that beginning of the line. So once you do that, we're gonna end this for part one and then we're gonna go to part two, alright? After this, we're going to start cutting it out. I mean, after we're going to start finishing the lines, and we're going to start cutting it out. Then, we're going to put it on either cardboard or whatever you want to put it on, because this is just a small little paper shield that's only used for, like, props and stuff. And eventually, we'll either color it with paint markers or we'll spray paint it. So, yeah, this is the end of part one, guys. See you guys later. Master Shoes out for now.